Hey there YouTube, another quick tutorial for you on Autodesk 3DS Max 2014. Um, right now we're going to teach you how to uh, uh, go ahead and select, like, get to, to edit to uh, rotation of two objects. So we're going to go ahead, I want to be able to rotate the eyes at the same time. Um, so they kind of follow the same line of path. So first of all, we're just going to um, we'll left click and hold control and left click both of these uh, glasses. Right click. Um, we'll go ahead and hide these. We don't need them. So normally you'd have to go here and let's see, hitting the E key after selecting the eye to rotate, you know, or or you can use the rotate button up here. Um, so you rotate it up, and it does give you this nice little marquee in yellow, not marquee, a uh, little little dialogue up there in yellow right above the iris. Um, they kind of tell you where to go, where where it's at. Now to do the same though. So, sorry, I was grabbing more than one. I can try now to either eyeball it and get it as close as possible, but as you can tell, there's, there's going to be a little bit of difference. So, I'm just going to control Z, control Z, get back here. So, the way to do this to edit uh, them, I mean, you can, you can go ahead and actually get really precise. So, let's say we want this rotated upwards around the x-axis like 13 degrees so you go ahead and left select the eyeball go up here to your uh, select and rotate tool we're gonna right click this brings up this nice little dialog box um so let's go ahead and note this date oh. so you can you know you can work on this get this figured out to go where you want it to go so it's 50 there, and you can keep going. Oh, see, now I selected pupil. See how annoying this is already? Uh, you can go ahead and select it and do it this way. Or, what I would rather do, um, you know, to, to be able to do this to both, go ahead and left click, hold control, left click again, and come up here to your selection, your rotate tool, right click, and now you can go ahead and edit both of them at the same time. Uh, very, very useful. Otherwise, you can still, you know, you can rotate both of them um, as if they were one entity. And they will follow that in the same line of sight. Um, you can move them as well, which is pretty nice. So if I want him looking over to the right, like that. I mean, obviously, there, there would be some fine-tuning. You know, we might go in here now, maybe rotate back here. Rotate the eye back in, so it's it doesn't look so so awkward. Again, same thing. Let's go here, rotate around. We kind of come out like that, you know. Ah, that didn't come out as well as I thought it would. Well, anyway, that's not the tutorial we're working on. So, you know, you can come in through here, fine tune it how you want it to be. Um, see, there you go, really quickly. Kind of looking over to his left, our right. Um. Uh, that's all I have for you. Uh, thanks for watching.